What's going on, everybody? This is Lady Luck here again. All right. It's time to get some Angelina Jordan in. As you guys may or may not know, she has been touring. And I am so glad. Finally get in some great umami music. Once again, you guys, listen. Angelina Jordan was, one, uh, was the very first Focus of the Week winners here in the Lady Luck Club when I started this channel. And, oh, my God. Her voice is amazing. She's been amazing since six years old. <laughs> and it just ages like a fine wine. And her vocals are just going to transcend through time. Your great-great-grandchildren will be talking about the vocals of Angelina Jordan. Yep. Household name. And I am a fan and will always be a fan. And um, I am excited to be able to dive back into her music and especially her tours. I cannot wait for her album to drop. I am ready for this umami music. Oh my God, her vocals are pure gold. So we're going to check out, um, this is three songs in one video. You guys know that I'm doing at least two um, songs every reaction video so this is going to be the first of two videos that I'm going to do both videos are from her um, tour um, that she did and a uh, poster who posted these up the Tom 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 <laughs> he, he posted up the, the two videos that we're going to check out in this reaction so we're going to do um, this first video and then the second one that I found from the same um the Tom Tom Tom. Um, we're gonna check out that second video. It's got Bohemian Rhapsody in it, and I'm ready for it. So we're gonna just go flow one video to another video. You guys make sure you hit that like button and subscribe if you're enjoying what we're doing here in the Lady Luck Club. We have fun and we're rocking some of the greatest vocalists that I have always said need to be more widely known more mainstream her vocals are unique one in a lifetime type of vocals nobody sounds like her i don't know anybody that sounds like her and even when she's doing tributes and singing you know covers from other great artists she still has a way of putting in her own twist and her own sound into those covers and you you gotta appreciate the artistry and the, and the craft um and just the musical genius behind it, even with her music videos. I mean, just the visuals are stunning, stunning. I have a whole reactions to Angelina Jordan playlist on my channel. So you guys make sure you check out that playlist. Dozens and dozens of videos um, of, her, of her music, whether it be originals, covers, her AGT performances, all there. <laughs> I, I pretty much I'm trying to make sure I catch every video I find of Angelina Jordan and react to it especially you know the great part is none of them are repeats um it's not like I did the same you know performance or or song or video twice so that goes to show how you know huge her catalog is and even when she does perform you know, like Bohemian Rhapsody again. It's such a fan favorite. It's one of my personal favorite covers that she's done. That Yellow Brick Road. I can hear her sing that over and over again. I don't care what she is. Because they're phenomenal. And her her twist on Bohemian Rhapsody has to be one of the greatest covers that just reverberated around the world. My God. She broke the internet. All right. So we're going to get to it. Like I said, you guys hit the like button and uh, subscribe and also check the description of the video for ways to donate to the Lady Luck Club, as well as information on how to follow me on Instagram and Twitter. I plan on posting up the links to these videos on um, Instagram and Twitter um, later on this evening. So let's get to it. Dance, have a good time. 
I'm dancing with these ladies. Killing me softly. So I'm, Ooh, ready I'm ready for it. <laughs> I'm ready. Oh, God, yeah. Let's go, let's go. has a faster tempo and then you had a version done by luther vandros the fujis uh, with lauren hill and each one of those versions are different I, my personal favorite is luther vandros's version because the dynamics of the music are uh, so beautiful with the orchestra with the with strings and Luther's voice is just timeless. But I love the fact that she has this jazzy take on it. And you can jam to it. The beginning was so beautiful and soft. And then it 
goes into this up-tempo, jazzy, almost soulful um, spin on the song. So good. You can enjoy this song, whether it be up-tempo or slow, mellow, jazzy. <laughs> it, it, it can have a pop to it, a beat, hip-hop almost with the, with um, uh, Lauryn Hill and, and uh, the Fugees. They, they pretty much put a hip-hop rap in it. I mean, this song, the lyrics is so beautiful. It doesn't matter how you cover it, in my personal opinion, because it's just such a good song. But the fact that she is giving this jazzy soul, and I mean, her vocals, oh my gosh, she has to be one of the greatest jazz vocalists in our era. And it's just, it goes without saying. Her, her voice is just... You, you can't compare it to nothing and no one else, period. And this take on this is so good, so good. And she's killing it with those runs and those little riffs she's throwing in there. Oh, my God. Does a music video with that. Oh I'm not God. the only one. Oh. <laughs> You're so sweet. Um, so next song, next song is called "I'm Not the Only I'm not One." The only you guys, one. you know, might have heard of the song. Um, and y'all ready? Yeah. yeah. I can't hear you. Yeah. 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 I can't hear you. All right, let's go. All right, let's go. <laughs>
around these people. Why are they sitting in this concert and they not up dancing? And they getting this type of singing? Are you kidding me? Where is she at? <laughs> Y'all ought to know better than this. This lady up front in this white shirt with the black floor arrangement in it, she knows how to have fun. I don't care if she don't want up there. She knows that's how you do it. That is how you attend a concert outside with the breeze and great music, great singing. That is how you enjoy a concert. <laughs> She's got the right idea. Everybody else sitting down. What are y'all doing? <laughs> I don't understand this. Top, top, top. You should have got everybody to get up. She is killing this song, y'all. I don't know if y'all are hearing the contortion of those notes. The key changes. So good. So good. With that, oh, that jazzy sound. Oh, my God. She could do some jazz music. Huh? She could do any type of music. But goodness gracious, her vocals are something else. to do these two in the same reaction this is her bohemian rhapsody and yellow brick road i'm ready for it so ready for it oh she broke the internet with these two songs these perform songs were performed on agt champions and she broke the internet i think this is like the first two or three songs i ever reacted of hers Oh my God. I literally, when I heard her do Yellow Brick Road, I was like, is she for real? <laughs> Yo, it's like her voice was so unreal because she was, she's so young. I, she's 16. Good God. People, y'all send me that in one more time with all caps and an exclamation point. I'm going to call you out. I'll be yelling in my comment section. <laughs> she's 16. This girl has taken these two songs and mastered them in a different version and went on AGT Champions and broke the internet. They are so amazing. My personal favorites of hers, and we're going to get into it in the same video. I'm excited. Let's go. Sing it! Mama, 
Ada. She's gonna do it, but I'm sick. Fight it anyway. Woo! Top, top, top! Thank you for recording this, man.
to do that together good googly moogly so good i had to take my glasses off y'all oh y'all almost making me cry so good so good oh that is so masterfully done masterfully done bohemian rhapsody the the entire cover is just genius. Her take on Bohemian Rhapsody and then Yellow Brick Road. This is why they are my absolute two favorite covers of hers so far. I mean, because of the fact that she takes these songs and just it, it almost become almost becomes two different songs. I mean, it doesn't take away the essence of the original sound from the original artists who are both great. Our Queen is my favorite rock band group. Freddie Mercury, just a legend. So is Elton John. You gotta, you gotta love and appreciate the music that they gave to us, to, to humanity. But her take and covers on that just transforms them into something so unique and special. For her to be able to masterfully cover them the way she does. Oh, my God. And it's that's, her sound comes through so well. Her vocals, those runs. Yeah, that jazzy, soulful tone. Umami music. That's my phrase I gave her. She got a whole new genre of music for me. Umami music. Oh, man, have I missed this. <laughs> it's just. So, so good. So good. Ah, oh, man. I'll be able to sleep peacefully tonight. I'm going to get a good sleep. <laughs> I can't wait to this girl get this album out. I would love to see her live. If she ever comes to Atlanta, Georgia, I will be at that concert. Screaming and hollering and probably throwing some socks if I can. They might kick me out. <laughs> but, you know. I hope you guys enjoyed that. That was phenomenal. I am so glad. Oh, this feels like I was a part of the concert experience. So I'm glad I did both of these videos. Thank you, Tom, 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 for recording these videos. May your channel blow up, sir. Because <laughs> this was golden right here. This video was golden. And everybody is excited on their feet. I, I don't know if they're sitting or standing or what, but you can tell everybody's just excited. These two songs of hers are just, these covers are classics for her. I mean, they're so good. So good. Um, I want you guys to continue to stay safe. I want you guys to continue to take care of yourselves and take care of each other. And until the next video.